some trade spooners for trade spooners for our pick for February well, on a board. Sorry about that. We're going to take a look at a long North Folk Southern Corp ticker symbol NSC. Now, taking a look at the pick ratings, we have the risk reward rating at a two, so it's on the low end of the curve from that one to two ten scale. But we have the value momentum at a seven. Um, which is on the higher end of the scale, getting closer to that 10. Taking a look at the price action, we see that the closing price uh, on the 11th was 93.11, and we see it's right off of those 52-week highs of 95.09. The momentum has been to the upside, and it looks like it's sticking. 52-week low is 69.15, and we've had a big spike in implied volatility, but it's being reflected here because we had a little blip in the radar. And what I mean by that is, is if you look at the volatility graph right here from our friends over at Trading Block, you can see that there was an intermittent spike up to 194. The green line or that green indicator is where the implied volatility. Um, that actually is errant. You actually see that the implied volatility right now is being run. And if we scroll down here, uh, you can see that it's actually at right around 34, which is off of the lows of 23 by about 10 points. So that is a uh, significant rise, almost uh, 50%. So that means that there is heightened expectation of movement, and we want to keep an eye on that. The return on capital, and again, if you're ever wondering how we come up with these computations, just hover over the question mark. Um, for the spreads is 36%, and the probability of success for that spread is 50%. The estimated move Going into February expiration is being priced at $1.70, but that can change as volatility and expectations change, as well as as we get closer to expiration. Now, the stock trade is we're going to buy stock and NSC at 93.11, and we're going to put that in as a limit order. When we're filled, we're going to put our target gain above our entry price because this is a long strategy. So we're going to put it in $8.25 higher, which is roughly going to get you out right around that 101.30 level. So you can put a sell limit right around that 101 and some change. You're going to put a uh, sell stop below your entry price by $8. So your sell stop is going to be right around that $85 mark. For the option, and again, as far as size management, use prudent size management. 3 to 5% of cash available or percentage of buying power. Um, the options trade, we're looking to buy the February $92.5 calls for a limit price of $1.60 or $160 per contract. Our target gain is $1.60 higher than our entry price. So in this case, if we're filled at $1.60, we're going to put in a sell limit good until cancel out there for $3.20. We're willing to risk the $1.60 that we're putting into each contract or $160. So again, use prudent size management. Um, we've suggested in the past anywhere from 2.5 to tops 10%. Um, the option spread trade is we are going to actually do a put credit spread or a bull put spread. This is a, a bullish position where we're selling the $92.5 puts, and we're going to buy some protection below it. Now we're going to receive a dollar for selling the 92.5 puts, and we're going to cap our risk in case the stock does start to go into a downtrend at $90. And for that insurance policy, we're going to pay $0.35, cents, which means our net credit for this $2.50 uh, uh, spread is going to be $0.65. Cents. Now, we're willing to risk about $1.30 on this spread. In other words, if this spread is trading at between now and February expiration, $1.30 we're going to buy to close this particular spread. So you can put a buy stop limit above the market. So at roughly around a buy stop limit of $1.30, which means that you're going to have a buy stop at $1.30, and then that will trigger a limit price to buy this strategy back at $1.30. And as always, use our proprietary virtual trade here at TradeSpoon to test out any one of these strategies, especially if you're new or have never traded these before. Uh, taking a look at the stock chart, you see that the price action has been to the upside, and it's been relatively strong the past few sessions. We like to keep an eye on the key stock events, and whether it's fundamental um, or technical components, and we'll list those here, especially earnings, which we don't have at this juncture. 
and always keep an eye on the news and commentary. If you ever need any help, questions, considerations, or you'd like to see something improved or changed or added, please email us at info at tradespoon.com. All right, folks, that is our pick for February 12, 2014. We're going Long North Folk Southern Corp, ticker symbol NSC. Thanks for listening, and have a great trading day.